Today here we have the Plum Ram 8 4G. To start this video off, let's go over the contents in the box. So obviously you have your box right here. You have your cable. You have your charger, your hands-free headphones, your battery door tool, your charging station, and your quick start guide, your user guide has all the information you need. So this phone is compatible with many service providers. It is a 4G GSM unlocked phone which means it is compatible with AT&T, T-Mobile, Metro, Straight Talk, Cricket, and I will put a list of all the other compatible service providers for this phone. SIM cards come in three different sizes. This phone takes a micro SIM card, which is the middle SIM card. If you do not have a micro SIM card, you can ask your service provider to provide you one or go to a cell phone store and get an adapter. Now I will show you how to insert your SIM card. Let's start off with getting into the back of the phone. You will use your battery door tool to open the back of the phone. Here you have the back of the phone. You will be inserting your SIM card into SIM card slot one only. Ignore SIM card slot two, that is just a novelty. Only insert your SIM card into SIM slot one. To open and unlock the SIM card slot, to unlock the SIM card slot, you will push down and up until you hear the click of the SIM card slot. Once that is done, you will gently lift up the SIM card slot Take your micro SIM card, place it in the slot exactly how I am showing you. To lock the SIM card slot, you will pull back down, push down, and pull back until you hear the lock. You can also insert external storage into this phone with an SD card. Inserting an SD card slot is optional if you would like to have extra music on your phone. So to insert your SD card, you will gently place the SD card into this slot, push up, and it locks in. After that is done, you will put back in your battery and the battery door. After that is done, open up your phone and press the red power button. Hold on to it until your phone powers on. Then you can let go of the button. Once your phone turns on, you will see your signal up in the left top corner. As you can see, it says 4G. It could take a few minutes to receive your initial signal, so don't worry if you don't see your signal right away. To adjust your call volume, you must be on a phone call. You simply use these arrows, the up and down key, to adjust the volume. Press the down key for lower volume, press the up key for higher volume. And to put the phone on speaker, you simply press the middle key and the phone is on speaker. To adjust the speaker volume, you simply use the down key to go lower and the up key to go louder. There are two ways to charge this phone. One, with just the cable directly plugged into the phone or you can use your charging station. You simply have your phone closed and place it onto the charging station. Make sure your cable is plugged into the charging station right there. Next, this phone has a few little features I would like to go over. The first one is the SOS button. The SOS button calls whichever number you set to call. 
So let me show you how to adjust that. You go on menu, SOS setting, and here you go on set SOS numbers, and you can put in whichever numbers you would like this SOS button to call. Next, the phone has a radio feature. You simply go on multimedia and go on FM radio. To adjust the volume of your FM radio, you simply use the up and down key and to pause the FM radio, you simply use the middle key to exit the FM radio. Just press the red button. The next feature I would like to show you is the quick camera button. Simply click the button and you now have the camera feature on. To take a picture, you simply use the middle key and it takes a picture. If you have any further questions about this phone, if you would like to know how to use any other features, you simply look into this quick start guide for the phone, or you can visit our website at plum-mobile.com. And if you have any further questions, you can email us at support at plum-mobile.com. Thank you very much for watching this video. I hope you have a good day.